Action 10 Chief Meteorologist Sharon Ray with your Doppler 10 weather forecast. All right, January's done and we ended up dry and warm. Temperatures coming in above average, about five and a half degrees for the entire month, lows and highs. These are the high temperatures we had most days above average, even some record highs, ending with the month with little on those cool note here. As yesterday, we were only in the 50s, but today we rebounded with the sunshine. Not much rain this month though. We've only picked up eight tenths and we ended up with three quarters of an inch deficit for the month of January. So now we're hoping we can pick up some rain in February. February, where the rainfall numbers come up a little bit. So February starting tomorrow, the average temperature is anywhere from 48 in the morning to 68 is the average high temperature. That's 30 years worth of data. But as we get to the end of the month, the temperatures continue to climb as we increase our daylight. You can see 53 for lows, 73 for highs. Rainfall comes up a little for February up to 1.9 inches. This is if it's normal. And then as far as daylight, this is my favorite. Oh, I love that. We're looking at later sunsets, earlier sunrises we're going to gain 43 minutes of daylight so a little more time to get outdoors in the evenings as you can see outside right now we have a beautiful evening we've got blue skies still a few clouds out there but the temperature came up a little bit responding to that sun today right now it is at 66 degrees and in the 60s across the coastal bend very nice start to our evening but we have dry air light winds clearing skies that means a chilly night ahead and if you live inland we're looking to drop close to 40 degrees as you head toward Tilden, George West, and Beeville, 42 at Orange Grove. So a chilly start tomorrow, 44 at Corpus Christi, Kingsville, and Ingleside, upper 40s at the coast. So after a very cool morning, the afternoon looks delightful tomorrow. We have lots of sunshine. There will be a few high clouds in the sky, mostly sunny tomorrow, and those temperatures climbing into the low 70s in the afternoon. And to top it off, the winds are going to stay light and the humidity is low. That changes a little bit by Sunday though. So temperature wise tomorrow afternoon, here's a snapshot of 3.30 in the afternoon. You can see those upper 60s at the beaches and lower 70s inland. Tomorrow night still on the cool side, we drop into the 40s to near 50 degrees for Sunday morning. And Sunday's even warmer and a little more breezy. The winds start to pick up from the south Sunday, but that brings our temperature up to 75 in Corpus Christi in the afternoon. So with no rain this weekend, it might be a good chance to get the car washed. The only problem is Monday. There may be a couple of showers out there. Certainly not much rain, but there is that chance Monday for some spotty showers as our next upper level wave comes in. Fishing looks good this weekend, but the wind starts to pick up a little bit on Sunday, but overall the bays are still smooth becoming slightly to occasionally choppy Sunday afternoon. Uh, Monday looks not that great as the wind picks up and we're going to see a chance of rain. Let me show you what's going on. It's uh, pretty quiet right now. The clouds are clearing. Our next system for next Tuesday is way out here in the Pacific and that's going to cool us down the middle of next week. Ahead of that, we have a warming trend, but we do have a little chance of rain Monday. The reason for that is once our ridge continues to build over us, watch what happens. This upper level wave tracks over the area Monday. That's why the clouds increase and we have that slight rain chance. A stronger system comes in Wednesday and Thursday and that is going to cool us down. Taking a look then at your Action 10 weather seven day forecast. There's the weekend. Not bad, huh? Early next week, more clouds Monday. It's windy Monday and again Wednesday. That wind really picks up. Notice the difference in temperature. It's warm Tuesday. We reach into the 80s for highs, but then we take a big nosedive for Wednesday behind that cold front for Tuesday night. We have more news for you. Stay tuned.